in um, in this video i'm going to explain about the uh, rl series circuit uh, the application of the first order uh, differential equation in the electrical circuit so if you consider uh, this uh, circuit uh, and apply the Kirchhoff's voltage law we'll have uh, v minus ir is equal to l di by okay dt i'm directly skipping one or two steps so if you apply the Kirchhoff's uh, voltage law here it will be negative of uh, v the source voltage plus the voltage top across the resistor and voltage top across the inductor and if you rearrange you will get uh, the equation like this and if you divide uh, both the term by inductor l so we will have v minus ir by l is equal to di by dt let's do some uh, rearrangement and let's do some uh, cross multiplications okay uh, i'm going to uh, bring uh, dt here by l is equal to di by uh, di by <coughs> mm -hmm. di by v minus ir so these arrangements are doing in order to calculate the initial uh, value at the inductor okay <coughs> and then uh okay let's uh, make the question like this v minus ir is equal to dt by l now let's try to uh try to apply the integrations on both side if you try to integrate both side or from here uh, you can also apply the uh okay when you have the circuit like this v is equal to ir plus l di by dt in order to apply the pass order differential equation you can also apply the labless transform okay labless transform can also one of the you can also apply the one and the labless transform to get the final equations in the time domain last night the time domain are top number so for this uh, okay i'm using the integration and if you integrate this one this integration okay so this integration is same as like integrating d of x by x so you should know the solution for this one here uh, you have x component x is compared with the i it is uh, this part is integrating with respect to current i and here this part is integrating with respect to time t so for this one for this standard solution we have since that i is in the negative with the negative of constant r negative of the logarithmic okay ln of the function v minus i r divided by r is equal to now you will have the uh, constant times t okay the constant here is 1 by l plus initial condition okay let's keep it as a k now we have to calculate the value of the k let's take uh, since okay now let's take since i is equal to 0 at t is equal to 0 let's try to substitute there when t is equal to 0 our i is also 0 and then we are going to substitute in this equation let's name it as equation a now ln of v minus 0 times r divided by r is equal to 1 times 0 by l plus k which means your value of k is equal to value of k is equal to minus of ln v by r okay now we got the value of this k and then let's try to substitute that uh, substituting uh, equation b to a or we, we are just going to replace the value of k so we are going to replace the value of k in that equation so it will be negative of v minus ir divided by r is equal to one okay let's directly write t by l plus we have a plus but uh, since we have a negative in the value of k 
so you can directly write negative ln of v by r okay now let's try to uh, divide whole i mean the multiply whole the term by r so ln of v by i r times r okay times r by r so here also you'll have no r so this r r will get cancelled so we are, i'm not writing and then here we'll have r t by l minus ln of v and then let's try to arrange or bring the uh, the log term together ln of p minus ln of v minus i r is equal to r of t by l <coughs> okay and uh, now um, mm, okay uh oh uh, again uh in order to make this one into the standard one like uh, for example like uh, we have to uh, use the logarithmic uh, uh, formula in order to convert this one into this some of the, some standard thing like we can multiply uh negative sign to all so which means we can have like uh, negative of ln b plus ln of v minus i r is equal to minus of r t by l so this one uh, we can write like this ln of v minus i r divided by v is equal to now negative of r t by l so taking the uh, taking the exponential uh, to both side because we have to remove this ln so we can uh, take e to both the side so we will have v minus i r divided by v will be equal to e raised to minus r t by l <coughs> so if we again rearrange one minus i r by v is equal to e of minus r t by l i hope uh, is clear so i'm just dividing this this v by this v and then uh, okay let's try to rearrange our intention here is to calculate the current in that given circuit we have a circuit like this we have r l and okay back to source v r and l and we have to calculate the current so we have to make i r v as a subject a subject and then we are taking uh, that uh, one in other side it will be minus one plus e raised to minus r t by l so okay let's multiply with the negative sign again i r by b is equal to one minus e raised to minus r t by l so your current i will be equal to v by r times 1 minus e raised to minus r t by l uh, okay now this is the a uh, pass order uh, differential equal equation solution for the uh, rl uh, circuit so in the next video i will upload i will uh, prepare the video about the rc circuit for the uh, applying the pass order